My brothers and sisters in Christ, welcome. Together, let us pray, day one of the Novena to the Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, Lord of light, from your clear celestial height, your pure beaming radiance give the Holy Spirit. Only one thing is important, eternal salvation. Only one thing, therefore, is to be feared, sin. Sin is the result of ignorance, weakness, and indifference. The Holy Spirit is the spirit of light, of strength, and of love. With his sevenfold gifts, he enlightens the mind, strengthens the will, and inflames the heart with love of God. To ensure our salvation, we ought to invoke the divine spirit daily, for the spirit helpeth our infirmity. We know not what we should pray for as we ought, but the spirit himself asketh for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Almighty and eternal God, who has vouchsafed to regenerate us by water and the Holy Spirit, and has given us forgiveness all sins, vouchsafe to send forth from heaven upon us your sevenfold spirit, the spirit of wisdom and understanding, the spirit of counsel and fortitude, the spirit of knowledge and piety, and fill us with the spirit of holy fear. Amen. Together, let us pray one Our Father, one Hail Mary, and seven Glory Bees, in honor of the seven gifts of the Holy Spirit. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give, Give us this day, day our, our daily bread, and, and forgive us our trespasses, trespasses as we forgive, forgive those who trespass, trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Prayer for the Seven Gifts of the Holy Spirit O Lord Jesus Christ, who before ascending into heaven, did promise to send the Holy Spirit to finish your work in the souls of your apostles and disciples. Deign to grant the same Holy Spirit to me, that he may perfect in my soul the work of your grace and your love. Grant me the spirit of wisdom, that I may despise the perishable things of this world and aspire only after the things that are eternal. The spirit of understanding, to enlighten my mind with the light of your divine truth, the spirit of counsel, that I may ever choose the surest way of pleasing God and gaining heaven, the spirit of fortitude, 
that I may bear my cross with you, and that I may overcome with courage all the obstacles that oppose my salvation. The spirit of knowledge, that I may know God and know myself, and grow perfect in the science of the saints. The spirit of piety, that I may find the service of God sweet and amiable. And the spirit of fear, that I may be filled with a loving reverence towards God, and may dread in any way to displease him. Mark me, dear Lord, with the sign of your true disciples, and animate me in all things with your spirit. Amen. Act of Consecration to the Holy Spirit All my knees, before the great multitude of heavenly witnesses, I offer myself, soul and body, to you, eternal Spirit of God. I adore the brightness of your purity, the unerring keenness of your justice, and the might of your love. You are the strength and light of my soul. In you I live and move and am. I desire never to grieve you by unfaithfulness to grace, and I pray with all my heart to be kept from the smallest sin against you. Mercifully guard my every thought, and grant that I may always watch for your light, and listen to your voice, and follow your gracious inspirations. I cling to you, and give myself to you, and ask you, by your compassion, to watch over me and my weakness. Holding the pierced feet of Jesus, and looking at his five wounds, and trusting in his precious blood, and adoring his open side and stricken heart, I implore you, adorable spirit, helper of my infirmity, to keep me in your grace, that I may never sin against you. Give me grace, O Holy Spirit, Spirit of the Father and the Son, to say to you always and everywhere, Speak, Lord, for your servant heareth. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I thank you for joining me in prayer, and I'll see you next time for day two of the Novena to the Holy Spirit. God bless, and have a great day.